What's going on everyone? I thought I'd just make another review about uh, the latest member to my little firearm family. This is a Smith & Wesson 357 Magnum Model 6014 Ladysmith. And uh, when I saw it, when I had the privilege of being able to shoot it uh, at a local range that they had it available for, I just fell in love with it and knew that I had to have it. Um, this is the first revolver that I've ever owned, and uh, I'm glad I can say that it was a Smith & Wesson. Although, you know, there are definitely more affordable options out there, and it's totally fine. Um, I just saw an opportunity to buy this one and I took it. Uh, very, very beautiful revolver. Um, I'm not very, very good at going into deep, you know, specs about it. You know, there are certainly other reviews out there that do a better job than me. Um, but, you know, one of the reasons why I got it was because uh, of the ability to shoot both, you know, 357 and 38 special uh, ammo out of it. Although I'll probably be using it for 38 special cartridges anyway, uh, just because uh, 357s are uh, they're a pretty hot round to shoot. Um, the grip is absolutely uh, beautiful. This a beautiful rosewood colored grip handle. Uh, I had the privilege of being able to shoot it a little bit. Uh, a day prior to making this video. Uh, I shot some Remington HTP uh, 38 Specials 158 grain, uh, but I gotta admit it was a bit uh, painful to shoot after maybe 10 rounds. Um, I don't recall having that kind of experience when I first shot this revolver, so I'm hoping that the next time I buy some ammo, I'll probably get like a lower grain count, maybe 130, and hopefully I'll have a, a pleasurable experience um, just to make sure you guys know bear with me I'm working with one hand this is clear there's nothing in there in the cylinder and um, yeah I mean it's it's just a really beautiful revolver um, I mean you just can't ask for anything better than that just absolutely beautiful. Uh, and I also liked the fact that, you know, this is a revolver that they marketed and catered to appeal to women. Uh, unfortunately, you know, you got some men out there with fragile masculinity out there who feel threatened about buying a revolver that's titled Ladysmith or, you know, is marketed for women to, to own. But honestly, there's nothing wrong with having a revolver like this uh, in your collection. It's absolutely beautiful and it's fun to shoot, um, so don't let that stop you. Um, I may get maybe another revolver, a little cheaper revolver, one that's uh, a little bit more easy to dispose in the event of something happening, but uh, for now, you know, this is my, my first and uh, maybe my last, I don't know, but uh, it, it's beautiful. It's, it's very, very beautiful, and uh, I'm proud to, uh, to say that I own it. Thank you for watching. Hail Satan.